Hello, and welcome to another episode of Come With The Light and Reveal, where every Wednesday we talk about one of the beautiful stained glass windows here at NoHo First. This Sunday, we're gonna be talking about the young and the old. So today, I have a story about the young. Our window today is Jesus, a child in the temple. Look at the symbol up top. It's a combination of several symbols. The anchor represents hope and security. The book of Hebrews chapter six promises that we have this hope as an anchor. It is firm and secure. Sailors know that a well-anchored ship is not gonna blow around at the mercy of the wind and the waves as much. We have that foundation to rely on. There's one further symbol in regards to the fish. Jesus' first disciples were originally fishermen, and he said, come with me and I will make you fishers of men. But it doesn't just end there, because Christians early in the second century were afraid of persecution. So they would use a lot of secret symbols and signs to recognize one another, one of which was the sign of the fish. That's because the letters of the Greek word for fish are also the first letters of the words of the phrase, Jesus Christ, God's Son, Savior. Now look at the picture down below, which illustrates Jesus in the temple. When Jesus was 12 years old, his parents went to Jerusalem with him to celebrate Passover like they did every year. When the celebration was done, Mary and Joseph met up with their friends and began the journey back home. Not until the end of a full day of travel did they realize Jesus wasn't with them. So they sent back to look for him, and by this time, he'd been missing three days. Three days? Sound familiar? When they finally did find him, Jesus was in the temple. And even though he was a child, he was with the scholars. He was asking them questions. He was answering their questions in return. His parents were astonished. And although others were amazed by his understanding, his parents had a bone to pick with him. His mother said, son, why have you treated us like this? Your father and I have been anxiously searching for you. And Jesus responded, why are you searching for me? Didn't you know I had to be in my father's house? His parents were not as impressed with his questions as the scholars had been, and they didn't understand his meaning. They just took him home where he grew in wisdom and stature and in favor with God and man. In the picture, young Jesus stands with three scholars that listen to him attentively. They have scrolls representing human wisdom. These are shown as inferior to the divine understandings of Jesus. In fact, on the left, one scholar holds a scroll behind his back, almost as if he's afraid or ashamed of his limitations. There's another scroll that lies on the ground, untouched. Jesus, a child in the temple, was dedicated to our church in 1958 as a gift from W. Paul Jones and family. Thank you so much for joining me for another episode of Come With the Light and Reveal. I'll see you right back here next Wednesday for another window and another story. God bless.